Before this video starts, I want to give a shout out to the homie Charles2k. I'm currently using his clips in this video, so shout out to the homie. His link will be in the description down below. Make sure y'all boys go give him a subscribe. In this video, I'm about to show y'all boys the best working NBA 2K23 DC glitch after all the patches and after the newest season. With this glitch, you're going to be able to run up your VC extremely fast. Make sure you guys take advantage of it while you can. Drop a like, drop a sub, turn on post notifications, man, and I'm going to go ahead and get right into the video. All right, so look, man, to do this glitch, you want to try and lock the accelerator, accelerator perk if possible, because this will speed up this glitch. You don't have to have it, but it will help you make more VC. Also, this next step, you don't have to do this step either, but this will allow you to make more VC. What you guys want to do is sim to the end of the season, and hopefully you're able to get a max contract. To be able to sim to the end of the season, you have to become a starter, and I think you have to play a few my career games as well. But this will allow you to make to get a max contract, which will allow you to make more VC while doing this glitch. If you want a max contract, I think you have to win a championship, but I'm not exactly sure. But yeah, what you guys want to do is go ahead and sim to the end of the season. Hopefully you don't make the playoffs. If you do, just sell like four games in a row and then that will allow you to end the season. Now, after you guys end the season, it'll ask you, um, would you like to become a free agent? You want to make sure you hit yes. And then you can pick the very first team that you see. A max contract is 1,000 VC. So you can try to get 1,000 VC if possible. If not, just try to negotiate and get as much VC as you can. As you guys can see here, we were able to get 700 VC per game, which is still more than before. But like I said, you don't have to sim to the end of the season to do this glitch. You don't have to have the accelerator perk either, but both of those things will help you make more VC. So you're gonna be Gucci regardless. But you guys can see he was able to get a new contract for 700 VC per game. Now, after you guys have done that, you want to go ahead and, and adjust your settings if possible. You can put the game difficulty on whatever you feel most comfortable with. You can go for Hall of Fame if you want the most VC possible. You can go for Superstar, and you can keep the quarter length on 10 minutes or 5 minutes. It doesn't really matter. Now, after you guys have adjusted your settings, all you want to do is just go ahead and load up your next My Career game. Now, listen, man. In this game especially with the accelerator perk you should be able to get takeover within three shots so what you want to do is go ahead and green your first three shots and that should allow you to get your takeover like i said you don't have to have the accelerator perk but it will help the reason why we want to get takeover is once you get takeover you will not be subbed out of the game so whenever you get your takeover um you can immediately just foul out and you won't be subbed out that's why this speeds up this glitch because if you try to foul out without takeover it's going to sub you out and then you gotta go through cutscenes this is the very best and fastest way to take advantage of this glitch so with the accelerator perk all you want to do is get takeover as fast as possible and then you want to foul out you can foul out by just holding select on your controller and it will auto foul for you but you guys can see that once you get takeover you will not be subbed out and you're able to get your six files in a row and that will really speed up this glitch you see you should be in and out of these games within three minutes especially if you hit your three shots in a row now as soon as you guys get takeover and foul out um you can go ahead and hold a to sim out you'll go through the halftime cutscenes, and then once the third quarter starts you're able to hold a once again and the game will go ahead and run out and you guys will see that even though you fell out and did not complete the game you will still get your vc so yeah man especially if you do this with a max contract you're getting a thousand vc per game but you guys can see right here he done this glitch and then you will see that you'll still get your mile points batch progression and then you'll also get your vc he was able to make 727 but it really just depends on whatever contract that you currently have of course the more vc the better also with this glitch you got if you do this glitch every single game you also unlock your endorsements extremely fast as well so whenever you guys get an endorsement whatever it is um do this right here hit counter offer put your vc all the way up to six thousand and then put your incentives and brand bonus both on zero. You can put your VC on 6,500 
and then put everything else on zero and they will accept it off rip. So doing this glitch will also allow you to get your endorsements extremely fast as well. You guys can see his VC did go up and now you are able to spam this as many times as you would like. So just to show you guys, all you wanna do is just go ahead and load up your next My Career game. And in your My Career game, you wanna do the same exact thing once again. In this game, you wanna get takeover as fast as possible and then you wanna go ahead and foul out. With the accelerator perk, that will really speed up this glitch and it will allow you to get takeover extremely fast like I said. And as soon as you get takeover, you're able to get your six fouls in a row and that just really speeds up this glitch. And like I said, when you're in takeover, you will not get subbed out. So yeah, man, you should be in and out of these games in like three minutes. So yeah, you guys will see at the end of this game, after he gets takeover and fouls out, he will still get his VC. Took you got the sauce much. All right, so look, man, as you guys can see, as soon as you uh, get takeover and foul out, you will see that you'll still get your mob points, your bash progression, and then you'll also get your VC. And the more you score, of course, the more VC that you'll get, but you wanna do this as fast as possible. You wanna get takeover and foul out as fast as possible and do this for each game. And like I said, as you're doing this glitch for each game, you'll also be getting your endorsements, which allow you to get even more VC as well. So yeah, man, make sure our boys take advantage of this glitch while you can before 2K does patch it. And like I said, you guys will see right here that his VC did go up. So you are able to spam this glitch as many times as you would like. Just follow the steps, get the accelerator perk, send to the end of the season if you can to get a max contract. You'll be getting your endorsements, which allows you to get even more VC as well. So yeah, man, take advantage of it while you can. Drop a like, drop a sub, turn on post notifications, man. Shout out to the homie Charles. We out. Peace.